Welcome to our course about SolidWorks Utilities. In my graphic area, I've got two open documents. This one's Part B, and I've also got Document A. Now let's go to Tools on the Standard menu, scroll down to Compare, and let's select Documents. Here's the Compare Property Manager. Under Items to Compare, Document Properties is checked by default. Let's click the Options button at the top of the panel. Here we can further specify which options to compare, units, tolerance, etc. Then we select a reference document, I'll use Part A, and the modified document, Part B. If the part you want to compare isn't open, you can still use them, just search by clicking the Browse button next to the drop-down menu. Select your document and click Open. I'm just going to cancel out though. Now click Run Comparison. So SolidWorks has compared my files and stacks them vertically in my screen. In the Compare panel on the right are the results of the comparison, file properties like size and when it was last saved, part properties like mass and volume, coordinates, feature count. The Save Report button. We'll learn how to create a report in a subsequent video. For now, let's click the Back button. We can select new documents to compare and do the comparison again. If I try to change a feature while I'm in Compare mode, I'm not able to enter Part Editing mode. Let's cancel out and exit. Now let's make some changes. I'm going to apply a material. Let's say a 1060 alloy aluminum is fine. Let's run the comparison again. Go to Tools, Compare Documents, select the reference document, then the modified document and click Run Comparison. And here are the results. Numerous properties are compared. By the way, if you rotate your model in one document, it rotates in the other, as you see here. Let's cancel out a compare mode. This concludes our first tutorial about using the Compare tool. In our next video, we'll learn about comparing features and we'll work more closely with the Compare options.